The impetus for change on Seabreeze Boulevard started with new ownership at the Plaza Resort and Spa, which anchors the east end of the boulevard. They saw an opportunity, but plenty of other business owners say they're on board, say it's high time. We've heard things before. This time, I think maybe something's going to be done, and we're looking forward to it. Lyle Trachtman has owned Seabreeze Fine Jewelers for decades, but says in recent years, the area's struggled with image problems. Fewer family-friendly businesses, more nightclubs and bars, sometimes drawing rowdy crowds. Police responded to the boulevard nearly 2,400 times last year. In addition, Trackman says the area just doesn't look as good as it used to. I'd also like to see them the, all the properties just look better and a bigger variety of kinds of businesses on Seabreeze would be nice. Business owners in the area say with tourists coming to the beach, they need something to bring them across the street. They are going on the right direction and uh, uh, there, there's room for an improvement. An ice cream store, maybe another donut store, things like that just to bring people down here during the day walking around. Revitalization on Seabreeze Boulevard has generated a lot of interest, a big turnout expected for this first meeting. In Daytona Beach, Volusia County, Claire Matzwesch, 2 News. And one thing city officials are kicking...